see the yellow in there that says that says brass right there see that Little brassy nuggets. The fun thing about these things is I can strap them on top of my toes and drop stuff through the holes. Actually, I think that went right into those boots. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to drizzle water all over the place. Something like that. I'll do the trick. I'm just going to take this back to the storage unit. Take that faucet off later. Okay, let's get to it. Goodwill dumpsters. Huh. Empty. Take my consolation prize. Three cents of scrap metal. What do you think about that? <sighs> Gigantic steel rotor in there. I didn't see it when I first pulled up. I'll turn the camera on because I think there might be some stuff in this bag. Uh, there's not. Well, a consolation prize. Actually, that rotor in there is a really nice score. It's a metal lamp, so I'll take the whole thing. So I went for this sink, and now I'm working my way back towards to where I live. Might want to move. Like getting run over okay giant rotor that came off of a truck of some sort i do believe Alrighty then It's not as big as I thought. It's still a good size one though. Oh. And there's only one. Usually where there's one, there's at least two. I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that can tell me exactly what kind of vehicle that came off of. I don't know if someone could tell me why these rotors are being thrown away. I mean, there's no grooves in there and there's just a tiny little bit of lip you can feel there. Isn't that just a really nice rotor? That's one thing I don't ever understand. Almost all the rotors I find just seem to be in such nice condition. I don't know. Am I wrong? Is that is there something wrong with that rotor?
uh, eight six two dollars forty cents, two dollars fifty cents or so. That's a nice little chunk. That's a pretty cool little dude. What do you think about that? That's not too bad. That's in really nice condition. Nah, uh, nah. It's got some. Some pizza sauce or something on there. A little, little graffiti. Still in nice condition though. That's what I wanted to. Okay, what are we dealing with in here? Nasty piece of aluminum. That's a nice little wood box. Put a monitor in there. Let's see if I can grab them. There we go. That's a little basket with a mirror bottom. Was that like a little little bathroom tray or something? What does that say? Ross. Uh, what that is it's kind of neat though nice little wood box that's definitely curb swag and I'll take my enormously heavy piece of foil might have to come with us, what do you think? I got a good idea for him. There's something you don't see every day. A printer with the brand new packaging tape still on it. It's dusty. How to explain that, dude? Um, I'm just gonna say there's something wrong with that thing. Well, there it goes. Well, now I just broke it. <laughs> I was gonna put that in the curb. I just busted the hinges off. Well, that's one good thing about this stuff. It's hard to trash garbage. It's not a bad table. I might have to come back by and snatch that up for the curb. down there but I think that'll serve its function though it's good what do you think I'm gonna come back and get that scored a little vacuum cleaner I don't know how exciting that would be for everyone I keep showing those <laughs> See, I believe we had a boot with some brass in it. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, I don't know where that came off this piece of tile off the sink. My tape gun. I originally was gonna ship that package from the post office over by where the sink was, but I forgot that they don't have a hopper big enough for a double package, that's, or a package that size. If those were sold individually, I could have put it in their little night slot, but. I'm a trash pick in action. I walked my dog by here last night. And there was a really nice bicycle. Hopefully their hopper's not jammed up like it is half the time. Seven. Oh, I didn't see it. Look at that. That's so annoying. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay, get rid of this finally. I got a video coming up about circuit boards. Selling them to boardsort.com. Been meaning to do that. Okay. Cinder blocks I've had here sitting for a while. I was gonna put my big aquarium on all these, but that big aquarium sprung a leak so now oh, I've got a good use for them people often make the comment I need a trailer or a little truck but no I don't it's gotta be a comment I keep getting but, um, As long as, as long as you're in a constant state of production, it really becomes irrelevant, the size of your cargo capabilities. I mean, there's another weed eater back there. Dragging a trailer around on a two-wheeler is basically a nightmare. Anyways, <laughs> hey, I thought that was a hose. Those are steel springs right there. So. A two-wheeler with a little motor. I mean, I weigh 180. If I have 100 pounds of scrap metal, that's 280. And a trailer by itself is going to weigh 40, 50 pounds. So <laughs> you're talking about three, 30, 350 pounds without even putting anything in the trailer. You know, it's kind of ridiculous to consider that. You actually understand what you're talking about. No offense to the people to say that, but it's a nice little chunk of car parts in here. And the whole point of using a little two-wheeler is to be in and out as quick as possible and to not attract attention. And if you're dragging around a trailer full of stuff, I mean, <laughs> about the worst possible thing you could do. That appears to be all scrap metal in there. So, oh boy.
this loaded up. I should have checked to see how sturdy it was actually. Oh hey, yeah, that's definitely doable. Probably stick a little wood glue in there, tighten it up a little bit. I know it sounds ridiculous, but could you actually put this in a car? <laughs> or a full-size mountain bike? <laughs> you can't even put that stuff in the car. I know it starts to sound like I'm recommending people to use a scooter to do this when I start explaining why I use a scooter. And I, I actually can't suggest or recommend anyone use a scooter like this. It can actually be quite dangerous. I've just been doing it so long. It's just, it's just I mean, I don't even think about it anymore. <laughs> it's just a super simple thing for me to do. 